Okay. Hello guys. Jacob is back here again. And by this time it's not going to be a tutorial. I'm gonna be showing you guys. I'm going to be showing you guys an app review on an application which is known as uh, um, Simon Notes. This application allows you to easily take down and organize sermons. Okay, so before I show you the application or the link to the application on the Play Store, let's just take a look at it. Okay, so let me just open it right here. Sermon Notes. Okay, so the app is now open. You can see a list of sermons I've been taking. And then I want us to right now. I want, I want us to create a new sermon. Let me just delete this one. No, delete, delete. Okay. So we, I'm going to name the title the sermon, the Word of God. The same thing. The Word of God. I'm going to give the preacher a bishop. Yeah. So you can see this sweet drop down because the bishop the names there have already been stored in the application so you don't need to write it down again you just have to select it same goes with the encounter same goes with the service i don't need to write them down again so let me just type something in the beginning the beginning was the word Genesis 1 verse 1. So let's check if that's true. You just tap on Genesis 1 verse 1, open the Bible and see what that tells us that. Okay, so this is what Genesis 1 verse 1 says in the beginning, God created the heaven and earth. So we can see that we can see that the application has an inbuilt Bible, which is the internet. You can also find other versions of the internet, other versions of the scripture from the application. We have the American King James version, we have the American Standard version, Amplified version. Let me just click on the Amplified version. So the Amplified version says, "In the beginning, God prepared, formed, fashioned, and created the heavens and the earth." That's true. So what I want to do now is I want to copy this back to my scripture back to my sermon so i just tap and copy and then go back and i paste it here so let me just take this out and then i save it okay sermon has been saved the cool thing about this is that when i tap back on the sermon i want to read it I also have the scriptures highlighted for me so in case i didn't copy the scripture i can just tap on it and then get it back so i tap on it and then it, it displays the scripture for me from the bible so you can see in the beginning of the heaven and the earth okay so you can also place this into folders I'll paste this scripture into folders. So I have a folder here. I'm going to paste it in the scripture folder, which has nothing at the moment. So you just have to hold and tap, add to folder, select scripture, and then bam, it's there. So I can add this scripture. I can add this. Why do I keep seeing scripture? Sermon. Wow, wow, wow. That's annoying. I can add this sermon to multiple folders. So I can also add it to memory verses. And then it says bam. So when I go to scripture, I see the word of God here. I can read it here. When I go to um, remember this, I also see the word of God here. Uh -huh. um, this application also allows you to categorize or organize the sermons by the preacher in a service. So I have preachers here. You can see that Bishop Okobos there has a number of number of sermons also our bishop has one sermon because i've gone to action once this that was that was the beginning of the year dr elijah has one here 
a female is four, and so on and so forth. For a service to, you can see, Ambush Shop, when they want. So we have a card service, first love, first service, and all that. So, um, what I want to say is that uh, after all you've created this sermon, then you want to maybe move this, this to another phone. You can just back them up. So I go to settings, I back up my database. And then I can copy the backup from this phone to another phone. So I can do that by just going to the actual location, the backup, that storage slash emulator slash zero. You might not actually see it, let me go back. Let's just em slash emulator slash zero slash same one. So let's just go to that folder on my phone. Uh, right here. And so we have storage emulated zero. Then you search for similar notes. You can see then the list of backups stored. Or you can also do so by um, just going to your SD card and then you find the similar notes right here. So you can just copy this backup to another phone and then you view all the same ones you start from there. Okay. So, uh, this application is it's a very sweet application for church users. Those who go to church every Sunday or more than once in a week, maybe you go to church Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Sundays. You can actually use this to keep track of your sermons and never forget what you learned in church. So you can actually download this from uh, Play Store. Let me just get you the link. Play Store. Oh. Search for Sermon Notes. It's the first list here. The first on the list here. Tap on it. You're going to see... Well, you're going to see some screenshots of the application. So you can just download it from here. Use the church. You're going to be blessed. You're going to grow spiritually. It's going to be good for you. So I hope you guys download this application and stay tuned for more app reviews by Tech Hobbyist. See you guys. Bye bye.